Welcome to the Fight Dome. FFC 34 can be described as relentless. Every fight provided non-stop action along with plenty of aggression. In a kickboxing catchweight bout, Miletus Nightmare Kakubavas did something scary just 52 seconds into the second round when he landed a high right kick to the head of Jermaine Soto, nice kick right there. resulting in a TKO victory. In a six round super lightweight boxing match, previously undefeated Isaac Luna kept coming forward against Kevin Thunderstorm Johnson, but it was Johnson who rained down some lightning quick flurries. This is what the fight dome is all about. To win by unanimous decision. In the night's co-main event, it was a good old-fashioned MMA heavyweight slugfest. DJ Linderman and Tony Hulk Johnson traded blows for three straight rounds, and in the end, Johnson got the best of this bloodbath. That, as the old saying goes, is the face of a fighter. And won the fight by unanimous decision. And in the night's main event, Bruno Ghazani and Samo Petye sent the fight dome into a frenzy with an epic five-round championship war that ended up being an instant kickboxing classic. Ghazani, with an endless gas tank, just kept coming at Petye, using his powerful boxing skills to his advantage. But the champ Petye didn't back down, countering with vicious leg kicks to the body and a bunch of high knees. After the final bell, Petye was the one standing next to FFC President Orsat Zavko as he retained his FFC lightweight kickboxing title, defeating Ghazani by majority draw. This is what happens when you enter the fight dome. Guard your grills and knuckle up. It's on, brother!